everyone welcome to day five of vlog week so this is the last day of vlog week i hope you guys have enjoyed let me know if you guys want more vlog weeks but i'm really excited today um there's some good things going on first q is bringing me starbucks second is i am very excited because cinemark invited me to have like a private screening they said i could bring up to 20 people and obviously i'm not seeing 20 people right now so i'm just bringing my sister and her daughter and then her husband so it's my stepsister so q's coming it's just gonna be us and we're gonna go see harry potter because sophie my niece who i like love and adore um became really obsessed with harry potter over quarantine so we have like the entire theater just to ourselves and it's just open so like no one's been there before so it is like so safe this is not sponsored i just don't have my phone on me and i don't have the information but they are doing like private screenings for people and you so i've just been cleaning oh i want to show you guys this this is from the beauty chef i've had this stuff before i haven't used it in years so let me know if you guys have used it um this is the collagen inner beauty boost i remember i used to just put this in water um but really cute and then I got the Glow Inner Beauty Essential, so it's a bio-fermented whole food beauty powder for healthy skin, hair, and nails. I don't think I've used this before. Honestly, I find that like supplements and things like that work better than like skincare. Oh, it kind of got messy in the shipping, but looks cute. I'm excited to try this out, but I just don't know. Do I put this in a smoothie? I just haven't been making smoothies lately, so I guess we'll see. Oh, oh my gosh, wait, no. You guys are literally gonna die. Speaking of my niece, Sophie, she's five and she's perfect. Um, Killa Dyes is making like kid tie-dye sets. So I asked her one for Sophie. So if any of you guys have like a daughter or a niece or whatever, or a son, whatever, nephew, you get it. You know a kid. Um, Killa Dyes now on Instagram, the best, some of the best tie-dye sets. Um, she's doing it in kid sizes. So anyways, guys, like look at how cute this is. I'm giving it to her today. I mean, obviously it's 100 degrees out, like she can't wear it today. Oh my gosh, like, guys, I'm literally crying. Like, oh my gosh. <sighs> so, this is more for me than it is for her, you know what I mean? Oh my gosh, also, okay, I need to show you guys the book I read last night. Okay, actually first, I have another thing to show you. So I came home from the lake to this package from Alyssa, it's so cute. So this is her store. This is her store. It's just like vintage cute pieces. So obviously better for the environment. This is a Liz Claiborne purse. And I just think, guys, it is so freaking cute. Like I really needed one exactly like this. And I also love a chain on a bag. So I just think that's so cute. And then this is so cute as well. Like, oh my God, love. So check out her store. Also, if you guys go and look at it, you guys can use Kenzie 20 for 20% off. And like I was shopping on there and there were so many things. Like I love the cruise that I saw. I love the t-shirts that I saw. There were so many things. So definitely check her out. Last night I started Heartbones, which is not even started. I literally read it in one sitting. It's Colleen Hoover's latest book. Fitz is only in the crate because he's being crate trained and he doesn't spend that much time in there. And yes, I do take him out and I play with him all the time. I'm tired of the dog moms getting mad. If any of you guys have ever crate trained, you understand. Crate training, in my opinion, is really just the best thing for dogs. And he actually just goes into his crate all the time by himself. It's almost like he has a room and just lays in there even with the door open. So anyways... Um, I read Heartbones literally in one sitting. It was so good and I so good. Also, it's in Texas, which is cute, but they're like on the coast, so they're at the beach. It's a beach house, but oh my gosh, so good. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Okay, I just made myself some breakfast, but I am so obsessed with how I make my avocado toast that I literally had to make myself four pieces. I mean, this is like thin bread, but still, you know, like who has four pieces of avocado toast in the morning? Me. Actually, this is the first time I'm doing it, but it's just because every time I finish two, I always want more. So anyways, it's so good. Um, I use Dave's bread, obviously avocado, everything with a bagel seasoning, and the real kicker is the Trader Joe's glaze sauce. I've shown you guys this before, but it is honestly just like next level. I am like full movie theatered out, you know, just ugh. I woke up this morning and I was like, wow, we're going to the movies today. This is really, truly... Um, just the best thing never happened. But my Starbucks has finally arrived, only an hour and a half late, but I'm still grateful nonetheless, you know? Thank you for the straw. Some people don't get Starbucks delivered. So. I know, no, I'm definitely grateful. I'm just wondering how you were an hour and a half late to our plans. But I already told you, my brother called. Yeah, okay. It was a big thing. 
You're making me look like a villain. I'm not making you look like a villain. You're not a villain. I love you. Uh, thank you for my Starbucks. So I got the healthy iced dirty chai um, recipe screenshot. Ooh, really good. I tried this in I think yesterday's vlog and it was incredible. Today is gonna be the perfect fall day for me. Movies and I'm gonna come home, clean a little bit. I'm gonna make this beautiful, incredible soup I saw online. Probably read some more. I mean, it, it's 100 degrees out, but a girl can dream, you know? So I'm just choosing to pretend that it is actually just 60 degrees outside. And I'm already happier because of it, you know? We made it to Fort Worth. We're gonna have a good little family afternoon. I'm so excited to give Sophie her little hoodie. You need to get your nieces, nephews, daughters, sons, whoever you know. Oh my gosh, Kill It Eyes on Instagram. Like my entire family has Kill It Eyes set. My cousins bought one, I think my mom's bought one. Or they're going to, I don't know. It's it's really uh, popular, so I felt like she deserved her own. <sighs> Guys, it is so hot. I'm not turning off the AC because Quentin will kill me, but I'm gonna read off now what I was trying to say to you guys earlier. This is not a deal, I'm just letting you guys know. So, basically, Cinemark is having private watch parties. It says that the private watch parties start at $99. Prices vary by location and movie. New releases are more. So we're just seeing Harry Potter. So obviously that's not a new release, but you can book them instantly online and through the website, super easy, and then you can bring up to 20 guests. So we're going to do that, and then we're my sister and my brother-in-law are coming with Sophie. She loves her hoodie update. She said thank you so much. She's very excited to match with me and the girls. So anyways, we're on our way. It is so hot. I'm so ready for summer to be over. I'm popular opinion. I'm just so not a summer girl. Walking in with my really cute face mask, you know. So fun. Oh wait. Oh my gosh, please tell me they have the luxury loungers. Please. Please tell me. Like a luxury lounge. Oh. That makes sense. <laughs> Yes, oh, it's so cute. Oh, they do have the good seats, too. Mm -hmm. Wow. Good morning! Hello. Guys, just missed the beautiful view, the skyline of the city. So now uh, you really just can't see anything. But Dallas is just so cute. Gosh, okay. Seriously, I promise it looked so much cooler like 30 seconds ago. Thank you to Cinemark for giving us a theater. But I came home to some clothes that I am so excited for. So the first thing is my birthday present from Sab. Um, she ordered this like a month ago almost. Hey, please stop. And it just came in. But look, Casey Musgraves, iconic. I'm actually thinking today how I need more teas. So that's great. Then, love is Vogue. So our friends, Eric and Roman. Well, this is Roman's thing. Um, from LA came out with a new clothing line. So these shorts, which I don't know why I got them in a size medium These are definitely big on me, but hopefully I can maybe like just wear them like baggier than they're even meant to be Really cool shorts. I know that Quinton's just gonna end up stealing them from me And then this shirt which the quality of the shirt is like really really nice. How it fits. So dope Love. <laughs> I'll link it down below Wild Wild West and then guys my first boys live Set, which I have followed Boys Life for like the longest time and I'm absolutely obsessed with them. First off, the quality is incredible. It is the coolest thing ever. It's two girls who started this and they bonded because they both went through breakups with like brothers or best friends or something like that. And then they became like besties. So here's the back and here's the front. Yes, it is August and yes, I will be wearing this tomorrow. Like guys, I also ordered another set from them actually today. So most of the time it's like pre-order, so I ordered this like a month ago and then it came in, but I just think that it is like so cute. And honestly, I want like 17 sets from them because I will just be living in these until further notice. Like this winter, all I want to wear is Boys Live. That's like literally all I want. So tonight for dinner, I'm making this African peanut soup that looks so freaking good. You guys how I make it, um, I'm just following the recipe I just showed you on the Modern Proper. This is pretty much everything you need besides the chicken that's already boiling. And then um, I also 
forgot to get, well, I thought I had like, another can of crushed tomatoes, so I normally am stocked up on that, but I don't. So Q's running to the store right now because he's an angel. I'm boiling chicken just to shred afterwards, and then I'm gonna make it in my favorite Dutch oven. I'll have this link down below. That meal was absolutely incredible. My sister actually just moved into the city. So I'm gonna go to her place, help her unpack, um, bring her meals, lots of pantry stuff, a cheese board, all of that stuff. Here's my Love is Vogue set, it's so cute. Um, if you guys order, I would get a small. I normally would be between a small and a medium, but these are medium and I like tied them up. Also, they're like, I'm pretty sure it's unisex. Or I'm just an idiot, I can't remember. Um, but it's really comfortable and the quality is like actually incredible. Unisex. Oh, it is unisex, okay. So anyways, I am going to head over to Maddie. So that is the end of vlog week. I hope you guys enjoyed. Today was just like a really fun, good day. The soup was absolutely incredible. It was very different from like what I normally make and I really liked it, don't you think? Oh, today was epic. I'm talking about what I mean. Oh, no, but I mean, movies with Sophie, brand new Chef Kenzie soup. It was great. True. Charcuterie board. Oh yeah, he made a charcuterie board. Um, I am so excited for fall because I'm just gonna make soup like literally nonstop. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed vlog week. Let me know if you guys want to see more. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you soon. Bye.